So I'm Carlo Marobbio and I'm from University of Bari, Italy. And I working, I've been working for Ataxia uh, about eight years ago. And uh, we uh, use this drug, which is called diazoxide, which is a drug uh, normally used for the hypertension therapy. And uh, we found that this uh, drug, which is a, an activator of a potassium channel, uh, is able to induce the frataxin expression. And we test this drug on uh, three uh, cellular lines from uh, frataxic uh, patients and with three different degrees of severity. And we found that uh, this uh, drug is able to induce the uh, frataxin protein. And uh, we uh, also test um, uh, this drug on mouse model. Uh, we collaborate with Mark Pook and uh, we uh, test this drug with a um, uh, humanized mouse model of uh, Mark Pook and we found an increase of frataxin in uh, um, mouse uh, tissues, uh, especially in cerebellum, brain and heart. We also found an increase of aconitase activity, which is a uh, mitochondrial enzyme with, uh, which is damaged uh, in the Friedrich ataxia. And we found an increase uh, which is statistically significant in the brain. And also we found a decrease of uh, oxidative uh, stress in mitochondrial proteins, and especially in brain and pancreas and liver. So, uh, uh, Mark performed the functional study uh, with the um, uh, mouse model and he found uh, an um, improve of coordination uh, abilities of the mouse, in particular uh, time to take the cross beam and uh, stride length of the mouse. And um, we, we, we found a decrease, a slight decrease of locomotor activity, and, but uh, we, we, we have to investigate this, uh, this, environment, this, uh, this behavior. Uh, so uh, we update uh, this uh, work uh, by studying the uh, molecular mechanism uh, and, uh, the, uh, of the diazoxide. And we found that diazoxide is able to induce the mTOR pathway, which is a um, cellular pathway involved in cellular uh, proliferation. So uh, when we use the rapamycin, which is a specific inhibitor of the uh, mTOR pathway, uh, we um, uh, cannot observe the uh, increase of diazoxide uh, when diazoxide and rapamycin are put together in the cell. So probably uh, this process involved the, uh, this pathway. Also, uh, we observe a um, uh, nuclear translocation of NRF2, which is a um, uh, um, transcriptional activator of uh, antioxidant pathway. And uh, uh, Cortopassi uh, uh, found that uh, N uh, RF2 are able to induce the frataxin expression. So probably the mechanism is that the azoxide uh, um, induces uh, mTOR kinesis and this induction promotes the NRF2 nuclear translocation which is uh, involved in frataxin induction. Also, we test the toxicity of the azoxide in uh, three different cell lines and we used 100 micromolar, which is not toxic for, frataxi, uh, for ataxic cells. So for the future, we, uh, uh, we like to, uh, to uh, uh, contact some hospital to uh, start a small proof of principle with a small number of patients uh, to test the effect of the azoxide in the patients.